What is up here today, YouTube? Jigsaw0097 bringing you another Eagles video. This one has to do with Zach Brown. It looks like the Eagles went and addressed the absence of Jordan Hicks, guys. They went out and they picked up a linebacker, um, signed him to a one-year deal, and I just wanted to give my quick, <clears throat> excuse me, my quick takeaways on this. Um, I think this is a fantastic move, bringing in a guy like this. Um, Zach Brown has always been one of those quick um, linebackers, very fast on the ball. You know, he's got speed, which is great. Um, and in my opinion, he is an upgrade over Jordan Hicks, personally. Like, uh, Jordan Hicks has a serious injury problem. And for me, the best thing about Jordan Hicks was his ability to get interceptions. Um, but someone like Zach Brown is just going to be there on the ball constantly you know he's gonna be looking for the running back he, you can get him to be a QB spy um, he adds a lot of needed speed to the linebacker core and also the Eagles don't really use um, more than one or two linebackers anyway so now I'm seeing you know Nigel Bradham and Zach Brown that's gonna be the starting duo that that's just what it's gonna be you know we still got Kame Gruger Hill as well um, who's pretty good but other than that there's not really a whole lot to mention. Um, the Eagles did just bring in LJ Fort, um, but I think he's gonna be he's gonna be the odd man out now. I think LJ Fort was like an undrafted free agent um, after the fact. I think mostly they they did that to address the criticisms of not getting a linebacker, which you know I was very vocal about. But I did I did think that how he was gonna go get a linebacker, but I didn't think he would get someone like Zach Brown. So um, we'll just have to see how this pans out but um i think it's going to be a great move guys i think the the eagles have definitely upgraded here um they've added some much needed speed to that backfield you know with our with our dbs our linebackers and then you know we'll see what our secondary does our secondary is still kind of a question mark with guys like sydney jones and jalen mills we don't really know like how good they actually are yet so I mean, Jalen Mills, we kind of know. I, I think Jalen Mills is not that good. Um, and that's been proven time and time again. But we'll just have to see. But anyway, I just wanted to make this video to give you guys my quick thoughts on the Zach Brown acquisition. He was signed to a one-year deal, like I said. So that's also another positive. If he doesn't pan out, he can go and the Eagles can look for a linebacker next year as well. Um, but I'm excited about this season, guys. The Eagles, just they're not stopping. I think they, I read something the other day where they still have like 23 or 23 to 26 million dollars in cap space to, to spend, um, which is pretty decent for what they've added already, you know, and they still have money to spend. So let's just keep it rolling. I, I, the season, you know, we still got a ways away, but the season is coming. And I just want to keep seeing what the Eagles add to their, their roster. So anyway, guys, comment down below what you guys think. Um, I'd like to hear what you guys think about this trade. And if you are returning to the channel, thank you so much for watching. But if you are new, go ahead and hit that subscribe button as I will be covering the Eagles all season long. But with that said, this has been Jigsaw0097. I will talk to you all later.